Newly obtained photos reportedly show Manchester bomber Salman a body a day before Monday's attack. Security camera photos from a mall show him wearing a backpack with the tag still on it. Police say a body likely did not act alone when he killed 22 people at an Ariana Grande concert. I think it's very clear that this is a network that we are investigating. And as I've said, it continues at a pace. Uh, there's extensive investigations going on. A body was a British-born citizen with Libyan parents who grew up around Manchester. Three of his family members have been arrested so far in connection with the attack. On Tuesday, one of a body's brothers was arrested in Manchester, and today, a second brother, Hashima body, seen here, along with his father, were both detained in Libya. Anti-terror authorities there say his brother confessed to knowing, quote, all the details of the plot. That one? Cell phone That's video question. shows British security forces yeah. raiding an apartment building in Manchester Wednesday. So far, four have been arrested in raids around Manchester as the UK remains on its highest threat level. Hundreds of soldiers were sent to secure sites across the country. Extra guards were deployed to the Prime Minister's residence at Downing Street and at Parliament and at Buckingham Palace, where the changing of the guard ceremony, popular with tourists, was cancelled so officers could be redeployed. It has indeed shocked us all. Meanwhile, in Manchester, leaders at a mosque are denouncing the attack and encouraging residents to call in tips to police. This act of cowardice has no place in our religion or any other religion for that matter. A mosque spokesman says they have received threats following false anyone. reports that the bomber worked and there. An hour from the city center, a memorial has been set up outside a chip shop owned by the parents of the youngest victim. It just feels like the whole town is, is grieving. It, it just feels like um, doesn't it show support for the, for the family. You, you just can't imagine. Safi Russos was just eight years old. Robert Bumstead, Associated Press.